HTTP works is in a client server model. Let us say I call you, I am the caller, you are the receiver because I call you. Now you call me. Now what happened? You are the caller, I am the receiver. So if this person is initiating the request, it becomes a client and then this becomes the server. What happens is initially client send the hello, then this is going to act to this one and then there is a, a negotiation going between. I am not go that level because we have a different day we are going to deep dive into HTTP and TCP how this works. Okay, So I am not going to take it here now. So, but eventually works is if when you get the HTTP 1.1, you open the connection, you send the messages and then later on the connection getting closed. HTTP 1.0 what happened? You open the connection, send the message, get the response, close the connection. Each time you send the message, you open a connection. If the opening a connection taking 10 milliseconds, right? then when you send the 100 requests, it take 1000 milliseconds which is a 1 second. 1 second delay. To avoid that, HTTP 1.1, what they did, they made, okay, you open the connection and then you can send the messages, then you close the connection later on. For that, we are using a, some special header called keep alive. 